A servant of God, I am Robert Simon, beloved in Christ. Faith. We are continuing on the same topic, faith. We did see, number one, faith is not positive thinking. Number two, faith is not receiving what we believe, but believing what God can do. In my last talk with you, we considered Abraham, Isaac and Jacob all died in faith, not having received the promises, but having seen them afar off and were persuaded of them and embraced them and confessed that they were strangers and pilgrims on the earth. In today's talk, also we consider the faith of three boys, Shatrach, Meshach and Abednego from Judah. The faith of Shatrach, Meshach and Abednego in the book of Daniel chapter 3 brings out this truth in a very powerful way. Please note carefully what they say in verse 70. Our God is able to deliver us from the burning fiery furnace and also out of the king's hand. Nevertheless, they continued in verse 18 and say, But if not, but if not, what does it mean? God is able to deliver us even if he doesn't deliver us. Does it mean they doubt God? This in no bit is a sign of unbelief or doubt on their part. They believe with no doubt what God can do. That is really faith in all its senses. They believed what God can do. They didn't know only what God would do. Will God deliver them from the burning fiery furnace by performing a miracle of displaying his no less great power before the eyes of the heathen throng? Or grant to these boys a greater glorious resurrection and immortality by allowing those flames to lick their mortal bodies? Glorious faith should not be made akin to the gimmicks such as mesmerism, suggestive therapies, auto-suggestions, visualization by imagination and so on and so forth, which are practiced by many so-called servants of God in these days on the pretext of faith. These things may even in worst cases throw room for evil spirits to take advantage. At times, they are no better than magic shows. I'm sorry, please bear with me. Christian faith, a Bible-based faith in God, is glorious and altogether divine. It makes us believe what our omnipotent Almighty God can do. Amen. And also we should know what He can do and why. Now, but if not, of Shatrach, Meshach and Abednego is not the sign of doubt but a bold proclamation of their absolute surrender to God's sovereign will. I will, God willing, be continuing of faith in my next talk with you also. Till then, God bless you, God be with you. I am yours, Robert Simon.